welcome to another class okay so in this video we are going to discuss the third chapter of business studies that is business environment okay in last videos we discussed the first two chapters what was that the first one nature and the significance of management and the second one it was principles of management yes or no so the third chapter is business environment okay so as we know a business can be established but to successfully sustain it needs or it depends upon some factors okay so let us discuss that first before entering into the chapter okay so the first one it required finance as yes or no finance is the backbone of business organization so for finance it needs to depend upon financial institutions okay and the next one is labor for that it needs to depend upon society okay and uh, they are depending largely on natural for natural resources and uh, raw materials understand and uh, they depend customers largely for sale of good products and uh, services okay and uh, they depend government for legal support okay so the business organization they depend uh, many factors for its uh, successful running understand so these are the main factors on which they depend depends upon for its uh, successful run understand so these all factors are the components of a single concept called a business environment okay so environment means it is the surroundings only okay so in simple words how we can explain business environment business environment is the surroundings in which a business exist okay so it may include factors forces individual or institutions okay let us define business environment okay all factors forces individual and institutions which are outside the control of business enterprise but these may affect its uh, performance okay did you see these points here financial institution society natural customers and government okay these all outside the control of business organization okay uh, only okay how we can understand that uh, you see no here government okay government we cannot control the government so no government but this government decisions are being adopted and uh, it have an impact on business operations so no and here another example customers taste and preference okay it is also out of the control of business organization but it will also affect the business organization yes or no so the definition business environment refers to all factors forces individual and institution which are outside the control of business organization but it may affect its performance okay so business environment includes all factors forces individual and institutions which are outside the control of business organization but it may affect the organization okay and do you think that these factors which will stand still that means there will not be any changes never yes or no it is dynamic in nature dynamic means changing in nature it uh, keeps on changing always understand so here the changes that definitely affect the organization okay so here you listen changes no changes can be uh, two types okay what are the two types means the first one positive changes also there and uh, negative changes also there okay what is the meaning of positive changes positive changes means those changes which affect the business organization to grow and uh, expand its operation okay so that is known as positive changes we can call it as you no know, opportunities okay uh, those changes which provides an opportunity to the business organizations are called uh, positive changes understand and what is the meaning of negative changes those changes which restricts or uh, uh, yeah which restricts the operations of business organization is called uh, negative changes okay so as a business organization always we will be looking for what changes positive changes that means opportunities only okay so positive changes means opportunities whereas negative changes means threats 
okay that means those changes which restricts the operations of a business organization understand so what we discussed what is business environment business environment means it is the surroundings in which a business exists okay so business always depends so many factors for its a successful run okay so those factors that means all factors forces individual and institution which are outside the control of business but it may affect a business organization is called its a business environment okay so business environment is always keeps on changing so as a businessman what we have to do we have to do environment scanning okay what is the meaning of environment scanning awareness and the understanding of business environment is known as environment scanning understand so let us discuss the features characteristics or natural of business environment okay so we have seven point points to discuss the first one is all the external forces okay as we studied business environment is the sum total of all external forces that means the forces factors or individual institution which operates outside the organization but which, which has a impact on the performance of business organization okay so business environment is the sum total of all external forces okay not internal forces it is it is the sum total of all external forces only understand and the next point is specific and general forces okay so the forces can be classified into two that are that is the first one specific and next one general forces okay specific forces means those forces or factors which has direct and immediate impact on business organization okay so such forces are known as specific forces okay for example suppliers investors and customers okay so whatever the changes happens in the taste and preference of customers will affect only that particular organization okay suppose listen you are running a business organization uh, which produces coconut oil okay and the customers they are not interested to use the coconut oil means it will affect only your organization yes or no so the taste and preference of customers or the uh, impact or uh, ideas of investors and next one suppliers okay so these all will affect only that particular business organization so these factors or these forces will come under specific forces only okay specific forces means uh, those forces which uh, directly affect uh, or which has a immediate impact on day-to-day -day working of business organization understand so such forces are known as specific forces okay and next one is general forces okay general forces means uh, which affect uh, indirectly the business organization that means it will affect all business organization indirectly okay so example social political economical or uh, legal or technological changes okay these all will affect a whole that means all business organization in whole under the forces can be classified into two specific forces and general forces specific forces means direct okay those forces which affect a business organization directly and have an immediate impact on day-to-day -day operations of business organization okay and next one general forces means uh, those forces which affect indirectly the next one is interrelation the third point is interrelation that means you no know, the factors of business environment is interrelated okay the changes in legal environment or legal changes it may affect uh, economic or political changes okay and next one is the fourth point that is dynamic okay dynamic what is the meaning of dynamic dynamic means uh, changing okay business environment is changing in nature okay it is not fixed or we can say that it will not stand still okay it, it keeps on changing okay so as a businessman what we have to do we have to do environment scanning or we have to study the environment in constantly uh, so no then only we can understand the changes and uh, we can convert the changes into opportunities got my point and next one is uncertainty what is the meaning of uncertainty uncertainty means uh, future that means what will happen in future we are unable to predict yes or no so 
business environment environment is unpredictable and the next one it is complex complex means it is very difficult to, to understand as i told you already we can do the environmental scanning or we can study the business environment okay it is very easy to do the environmental scanning or we can uh, study the business environment okay but it is very difficult to understand how these changes will affect the business decisions okay so it is business environment is very complex okay you understand the difference between uncertainty and complex uncertainty means uncertainty due to unpredictable okay that means the future we cannot predict environmental changes we cannot predict so it is uncertain okay and whereas complex means it is very complex that means we can do the environmental scanning or we can study about the environment but it is very difficult to understand how these changes will affect the business organization so it is very complex to understand the totality of business environment got my point and the last one is relativity relativity means you no know, business environment is a relative concept as it is or since it is changing from country to country or region to region okay as you know the political condition of america and china is different from india and uk so no so the political and economical and the legal conditions of country to country and uh, region to region it is different as or no so the first one all the external forces that means business environment is the total of all external forces which are out of the control of business organization but it has an impact on business organization okay and next one specific and general forces specific forces means uh, direct impact and an immediate effect on day to day operations of business organization okay this point is very important because you know frequently cbsc asks question from this particular point okay that is specific and general forces give example for specific and general forces okay so example for specific forces suppliers investors customers okay so changes in these factors will affect only that particular business organization or that that single business organization understand so that's why it is known as specific forces okay and whereas general forces means it will affect all business organization okay changes in social uh, society or otherwise political changes economical changes legal or technological changes it will affect a whole business organization okay so that's why it is known as general forces next one interrelation all factors of business environment is interrelated and next one dynamic dynamic means uh, business environment always keeps on changing okay it is not fixed it will not stand still okay and uh, next one uncertainty as we studied business environment is keeps on changing so it is very difficult to predict the future environmental changes okay so it is very uncertain okay as complex means it is very complex that means we can do the environmental scanning or we can study about the environment but it is very difficult to understand how these changes will affect the business organization so it is very complex to understand the totality of business environment and uh, the next one is relativity what is the meaning of relativity relativity means uh, business environment is relative in nature because it uh, keeps on changing country to country region to region uh, understand uh, for example you know uh, the demand for sari in india is higher than usa or uk okay so these are the main features and characteristics of business